Hey, so I wanted to apologize for the way in which the video was shot. I did not intend the video to be shot uh, looking downwards. In fact, I wanted the video to be shot uh, forwards like this. Now the reason uh, this happened is because when you put these two action cameras on a dual mount and then attach it to the chest mount, it's going to get so heavy that it's going to stretch the elastic on the chest mount and the chest piece is going to droop forward. Uh, that's why the video was taken uh, unintentionally in the way it was uh, taken. Now, before going into this comparison between V50X and the GoPro Hero 8 and looking at other reviews of the V50X image stabilization performance, uh, my expectation was pretty high for the V50X. But the, the two videos clearly show uh, what really the GoPro Hero 8 uh, is capable of with its uh, HyperSmooth 2.0. Now in very rocky and shaky conditions, yeah, GoPro Hero 8 is going to have the, the far better image stabilization. But V50X in general, you know, it's not too bad. In the most uh, rocky conditions, it's going to shake and be jerky. But, you know, if you're not doing anything too extreme, if you're on a relatively flat surface or gravel, uh, V50X is going to do its job.
Sorry about that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.